Today I have finished the jam and toast chest mount for your smartphone. And let's be honest, right? Let's tell you, I, I've looked online for a decent um, phone mount for a chest, and all of them are rubbish. They really are rubbish. There is no good way to go. Oh, you know what? I really, really want that one. Even though it's like a thousand quid, I really, really want it. Even them are crap. Alright, so I thought, why buy crap when you can make crap but good? There we go. I call this the Jam and Toast Smartphone Chest Mount. And as you can see, it looks like jam on toast. Yeah, you know, genius here, yeah? genius. Right, so um, this here, right, can we do, this stuff goes for it. I mean, you can use anything, I'm just using this like thing, which was part of my shirt, because I know how round I am, so then I can use it. And it just like goes for here, and then it goes underneath there, and then it goes in here to keep the phone steady. And I'll put um, some water, um, waterproofing all the way around here and stuff. Oh yeah, put cardboard together and stuff, and this is how you run do it. Do this. Do, do. Luke, Luke, I am your father. And then you take this out here, and then you take this one out here, because this is really sturdy, you know. You can't drop this, you can't destroy this. Remember, it's only a smartphone, you know. My phone is an iPhone SE, so I built it around that. Right. Come on, so you see how hard it is to get off? See how hard? There you go, there you go. And there we have it. Um, no. Nah. See what I mean? It even gets tangled up. So, how's this going to fall off here? Look at that. Yeah, waterproof on the back as well. It's got a funky, funky glitter red glue on it. Yeah. So, all you do is make a bar, cut up a cardboard, and you put it on the thing. And then, you get some more cardboard, and you um, stick stuff together to make even more cardboard, and then you've got a brick of cardboard. And then you do it on the other side as well, and then you do it on this side as well, and then you do it on this side as well, and then you stick this in here, and then you press the, the jam and toast camera mount. Extraordinaire. Yeah, that. yeah, really, really pleased with that. And how much did this cost me, did you have? Well, it didn't cost me anything because I got the boxes for free I went and I bought the stuff off Amazon. They didn't even charge me. I mean, how bad business sense is that, not charging someone for a box? You know what I mean? They've got to be pretty nutty upstairs. Secondly, I bought some spanners from a bank and... Alfred's tried to sell me one spanner for like 13 quid and then this nice blog go, Ooh, what about these? Oh, these spanners for 12 99 And this was on top of it. So I cut it off and stuck it to the thing. So that was free. The elastic band was also free because it comes around medication and stuff. The bag was also free because that goes around medication and stuff. In fact, there's a lot of free stuff out there that people take for granted. And it's a good job I'm not in charge because I will shall be making dollar or pound. So there we go. The only thing it cost me was seven quid for the glue gun, which I probably, in a um, matter of fact, I probably would never have bought the glue gun and just used the prick stick. But, you know, when I was asking for advice from people at the time, they were just like, oh, I don't know. And then two hours, three hours, like, oh yeah, you shouldn't buy that thing. <sighs> That's the world I live in. Cheers.